This video is about how to use my spreadsheet to create a simple table of contents for a Squarespace website. Please read the full article on my website since it contains way more information and I update the spreadsheet from time to time. The link is in the description below. First, you will have to copy the CSS code into the website settings. The CSS code would give some design to your table of contents, and without it, the table would be just a simple unformatted text. Second, you would need to copy the spreadsheet and name it as you wish. To keep it organized, I usually duplicate the main sheet for each article. On each new sheet, you would need to delete the, the data in the gray area and uncheck the outer IDs. Then, all you have to do is to copy the subtitles from the article to the spreadsheet. As you may see, there is no subtitle HTML code yet, because we did not set the link ID. It can be done automatically by checking the outer ID field or by typing it manually. If the cell turns blue, it means that you used an outer ID and the data from the manual ID field is not being used. And by the way, there is a note to each column that explains what each color means if there is one. Next, you may also give a name to a table of contents, set the heading parameter, and change other settings. So now, we just need to substitute the actual subtitle with the HTML code from the purple field using code or markdown blocks. You may now delete the original subtitle. And as a last step, we need to create an actual table of contents by using the HTML code from the green field and inserting it to the article using the code block. That is basically it, and if you have any questions, please leave comments below or on my website.